Hi, and welcome to this new video about Chinese power supplies. Why Chinese power supplies? Well, uh, if you've been following my blog for a little while, I've been building these little modules. These are my ESP8266 based dimmer modules, and they feature the ESP8266. Oh, wait, let me turn that around. Uh, microcontroller to dim two MOSFETs, which you can see uh, right here, and that way I can control LED lights. The P PWM frequency is set to 1000 Hertz, and let me plug in the microcontroller for you because this board is a, a, a version 2.5, revision 1. But there's a bit of a snafu with it. As you can see, the microcontroller basically hits one of the MOSFETs. So I've made a new revision and I've sent it off to the board house where the MOSFETs get placed a little bit to this side. And that should fix it up pretty nicely. And uh, when that's done and we're all working, I'll share that revision online. And that should be all well. Uh, as I said, I'm going to power LED strips and uh, LED downlights with it. This is an example of the LED downlight. It's basically a cob LED inside of a big housing with a big heatsink. And instead of using the included power adapter, I'm going to power them with DC power directly. Um, there's multiple reasons for that. I'm not really going into that in this video. Um, but how am I going to power those? Well, using power supplies like this one. This is a Chinese version. And uh, it's it's pretty cheap. It, it gives 24 watts, uh, 24 volts at 5 amps. So about 100 watts. And as a comparison, this is a Meanwell version. This one's also 20, uh, well, this one's actually 36 volts because I need those for the LED downlights. And uh, I believe it gives also 150 watts. Or not also, but it gives 150 watts. And why do I have a Meanwell version and uh, a, a Chinese version? This Chinese brand is actually called let me see if it's on here yeah it's on here down here it's actually called junkie that's just why why would you name your brand you manufacture something and then put junk in the name I don't know must be a joke or maybe they just didn't know it's funny, but it's actually, it's an okay power supply. But talking about if, if it's okay or not, um, this video, and or especially the associated post with it on blog.quinorian.org, is about China, Ch or Chinese versus Meanwell power supplies. Uh, do they both perform the same? Is one better than the other? Is there a big price difference? Is there a big quality difference? Which one should you get? I mean, I like getting stuff from China, but these things are going to run 24 hours a day. They're going to run the lights in my house. So quality is of some concern. But if they cost four or five times as much as China, Chinese versions, well, that could be an option too. So, yeah. Uh, this will be an ongoing thing. I've enlisted Mux. Uh, he's uh, someone I, well, I didn't, I contacted on tweakers.net, it's a Dutch forum, and he's very good with efficient electronics, and he has all the needed equipment to test these power supply for ripple and stability and load test them, and uh, even has some um, thermal graph, uh, thermal video of them, and all kinds of stuff, but Check out the post, it'll feature all his videos and his conclusions and my uh, my conclusions and 
Well, hopefully we'll find out if China Chinese power supplies are just as good as meanwhile power supplies, or if they really aren't, and which one to get. So, yeah, check it out.